Now, finding the percentage increase or decrease um, is different to the other percentage increase decrease questions. Here, in this first question here, it's not asking you to increase or decrease by a given percentage. It's to actually find the percentage that's been decreased by. So if you have a look at this one, the cost of the maths group is, so the cost of the maths book is reduced from £9.50 to £6. Calculate the percentage reduction. Percentage reduction, percentage increase is always done the same way. So you look for the actual increase slash decrease. You divide it by the original, and then you multiply by 100. Okay, so the actual increase is decreased from £9.50 down to £6, so the actual amount that's gone down is £3.50. So £3.50 divided by the original price, which is £9.50, and then you times that by 100. So £3.50 divided by £9.50 times by 100 is 36. Point eight seven. Okay, so let's do the next one in exactly the same way, except this one is going to be find the percentage increase. So Ali grows tomatoes. For a school a minute plant food, a good plant food I can wholeheartedly recommend, the tomatoes weigh 35 grams each. After the plant food, they weigh 48 grams each. So they work. So the actual increase here, so the actual increase is 13 grams. And we divide that by the original. Now the original was 35 grams. And you times that by 100. So when you calculate, you do 13 divided by 35. Whatever answer you get, you times by 100. And that equals 37.1. Remember, it's a percentage increase, so it's going to be 37.1%. Now, it's your turn. So have a go at both these questions and see how you get on. And if you've done that, let's have a look at the first one. So the class size has been reduced from 32 to 26. So the actual decrease has been 6. And the original is 32. So we do 6 divided by 32, and then times by 100. And we get 18.75%. Now, at Christmas, Pimp Argyle had 24 points, and now they've got a mighty 53 points. So if we have a look there, it's actually gone up. So what we do is we do 53 take away 24 to work out the actual increase. 3 take away 4 we can't do, so if we borrow from that one, make it 13. 13 take away 4 is 9, 4 take away 2 is 2, so the actual increase has been 29. So 29 divided by the original, which is 24, then times by 100. And what we see here, if we do 29 divided by 24, times by 100, we get 120.8. So it is possible to get above 100%, and that's if it's more than double. And here, if we double 24, we get 48. So 53 is more than double 24, so therefore it's going to be over 120, so over 100%. So well done if you got those answers correct.